I feel like we came out weaker than what we could have. We could have played as a team more and communicated more often. But overall, I feel like second half, we started talking more, and that's what got us our, our win. Yeah. And another thing was we actually started playing better defense in the second half. And it was just momentum change offensively, so it worked well. It was more clarification. Like, it was recognition of what we did wrong and what we needed to fix. And that's what fixed the second half, because we pointed out our mistakes so that we can fix it the second half. It's like our communication on the backside end, we need to work on that. And once we get that on the table, we usually do better and focus more on that. Like, There's just like no fire in, in us like the first half. And it's like, it's upsetting, but we'll work on it. So hopefully next game we can, it can be the entire game opposed to just, you know, couldn't stop her. Yeah, they didn't, they didn't stop me. So <laughs> I did what I knew what I can do. And then Stephanie, you had a, you finished with a double double, 18 points. And uh, usually you think it would be assists, but you had a lot of boards today. So was that, you know, the, was the ball just finding you, or were you really going after boards tonight? I mean, I just thought that it just, I'd help out my post. I feel like it was half and half. Yeah, I feel like she got lucky, but then she <laughs> she was there too. Sure. I figured I'd help out my post and yeah. crash the board. For me, I was guarding one of their three ball shooters and. She was lighting us up, number 25, on, on the first half of the game, and they got on me about it. So I felt like that was a point of emphasis for me for the second half. And um, I know I was guarding their leading scorer. So I just knew since, since she had, like, I don't know, she had a couple of threes in the first half. So I knew I just had to buckle down and not let her make any in the second.